Love Me Like You Mean It is a big hit in the debut single for Kelsey Ballerini, who co-wrote the song along with Josh Keir, Forrest Glenn Whitehead, and Lance Carpenter. The song's in the key of E, and we've got some nice open chord variations that we're going to learn on the acoustic guitar for this song. Uh, there's really only just one strum pattern and one chord progression through the whole thing. On the lead guitar, we've got some background, some support parts, and then we've got some nice lead octave work that we're going to learn. We've just got one strum pattern and one chord progression that we need to get through uh, this whole song on the acoustic guitar. It's in standard tuning, key of E, and we're going to use some chord variations, but uh, if you don't like them, you can uh, pick something different. We'll talk about a couple different options. So, first one is this standard E chord. Open low E string, second fret of A, second fret of D, first fret of G, open B, open high E string, down, down, up, up, down, down. Down, down, up, up, down, 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 up, up, down, down. And uh, just a little bit slower here. Down, down. With a couple extra downstrokes in there, it'd be like this. All right, we're gonna learn everything we need to know on the lead guitar for this song. We're gonna start with that intro and outro octave riff, then we've got the verses, then the choruses, then we'll learn that bridge solo and the outro part. Uh, along the way, there's gonna be some banjo work and some mandolin work. We're gonna pick up as much of that as we can uh, without missing anything that we need to do on the lead guitar. So here's that intro and outro riff. <laughs> beat of the chorus we're going to just start with an open E string hammer on from two to four on that low E then we're going to get our fingers on a B power chord second fret of A fourth fret of D fourth fret of G go 